tenants of the lands, and we want to be a part of the solution. We believe collaboration and building partnerships with government agencies are the key to sustaining a healthy ecosystem. It's very important for our mission in recovering listed salmon and steelhead to work with private landowners in a way that advances recovery. My parents used to say, take care of the land and it will take care of you. My family continues to live by that philosophy. About nine years ago, we began having conversations with natural resource conservation agencies to see how we could play a part in habitat restoration and protecting fisheries in our local watersheds. Yellow Jacket Creek on our Knights Valley property became the perfect place to do just that. Yellow Jacket's a really special place. It provides cold, clean water year round. And finding cold water that runs year round um, in the Russian River, and particularly this part of the Russian River, is kind of unique. We have very, very low flows. Many streams that actually go dry during the summertime and fish can't survive there as a result. Living in California, drought is inevitable, which is why it was critical for us to prepare for this moment. There was a water diversion that created a sort of waterfall and that completely blocked adult and juvenile salmonids, steelhead and coho salmon, from being able to migrate upstream. What we did is constructed a series of over 30 weirs that overcame a barrier that existed upstream from here that was about 17 feet high at a diversion weir. These fish are iconic. Healthy and thriving populations of salmon steelhead means that we have a sustainable and reliable source of water. It means that we are resilient face of uh, floods and even droughts. Together, we can support conservation and habitat restoration and leave the land better than we found it.